Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Ali and we are here one more time with another unboxing. For this video, I'm super excited because this is my very first box for the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Um, I got, we are now in July, beginning of July, and I signed up for this subscription late June and I was surprised that they actually sent me a box for that month. I was expecting to be charged on the 1st of July or, you know, beginning of July so I can get the box for the month of July. But no, they actually ended up sending me this box here. It did just recently get here, but it's still for the month of June. And this subscription is $25 a month. It is a monthly subscription. Um, they do also charge you taxes on top of that. So I think I ended up paying like around $27 um, and change. So uh, you do get, I believe it's four to five products, full size products, and you are set to get at least $120 worth. I think this is a competition for the BoxyCharm box that is also a monthly subscription. You get the same amount of products and they are also full size for just a little bit cheaper monthly. Um, BoxyCharm is 21, this is 25. That's why I was very curious to get this one because I, I think I can say that BoxyCharm um, is my favorite subscription from all of the subscriptions that I have. Aside from them being full size, um, it is my uh, favorite my favorite subscription. So now I'm going to see how this one is. I know they, they do have a lot of different products compared to BoxyCharm. So I wanted, wanted to give this one a try. So um, no more talking. I'm going to go ahead and open the box and so we can actually see what we got this month. So here is the box. Once we open it up, um, you get your little protecting foam, just like you do on your other boxes. And this one says, don't be pretty like them. Be pretty like you. Um, empowering. So let's see our products inside. So just like with all of the other subscriptions, we get a little pamphlet here giving us information on the products that we have inside along with the prices. I'm going to go ahead and put this aside. Towards the end of the video, I'll go back in here um, so we can see the actual prices for the products and I'll go ahead and add all of them up um, so we can see the actual value of our box. So this is our first product here. It is from Apto Skincare. It says in the front that it is a healing mask. This is what the little box looks like. So I guess this is a healing mask with turmeric. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen my previous video with my Macy's box where we I also got a, a product that had turmeric in it. I wasn't a big fan of the scent. So I hope this one doesn't smell as much um, as the other one, like turmeric. So out of the box, this is what our little container looks like. It is a very yellow mask. Um, let's see what it smells like. Okay, so just smelling it like this doesn't smell too much like turmeric, which is awesome because I really want to use this one. Um, I actually read online a little bit about turmeric. Um, it's supposed to be healing and it's supposed to help a lot of uh, people that have acne, which I suffer from. Um, and it's supposed to be really good for your skin. I guess that's where the healing part comes from, from the mask. So I am more than happy to give this one a try, especially knowing that there's no scent. Our second item here is from 111 Skin or 111 Skin, um, Harley Street, London. It is a vitamin C brightening booster serum. This is what our little box looks like, just black with a lot of little white letters. And our bottle outside of the box looks just the same. It is a dark glass with white letters and it has a little dropper here. Let me see if it has any scent. Oh, it does have a scent. It smells really good. It gives me almost a like a floral scent. Let's put it on my hand. See, ooh, it feels nice and cold. Okay, so once you put it on, on your hand, it almost feels like water. I thought it was gonna feel a little bit more oily, but it feels like water. Um, when, once you finish rubbing it in, it does leave a little bit of like an oily residue, but it feels like it's going to all sink in. It feels really, really nice. I'm excited to try this out. 
Our next item here is from Tristique. Um, it is a matte color plus shiny balm lip crayon. Okay, so that sounds interesting. I wonder, um, here is a picture on the back. I don't know if you guys can see. I guess it's like one inside of the other that's inside of the other one, which altogether makes one big one. I don't know. This is weird. Never seen anything like this. So this is what the package looks like. And I think this is in Belize Bordeaux. I think that might be the color. Um, this is what it looks like. Um, it almost feels like a metal. It feels like it's made out of metal. It doesn't really feel like plastic. This is plastic, but this part here doesn't feel like that. I guess this is our first crayon here. This looks to be the matte color. So once we put it, oh, that's a very nice color. So that's our first color there. And let's try, oh, it's also magnetized. That's cool. So once you, cool. Um, let me see, balm. That's a very tiny little balm. So that is the second part to it. Took it out from here from the bottom. And this one actually clicks into place so you don't let it uh, fall out. Once you swatch it, yeah, this is just a clear, clear, clear um, balm. It smells like vanilla. It actually smells really, really good. Um, so these are the two. I'm not sure if you're supposed to wear these together or if they're just meant to be separate. Let's see. If we put it on top, yeah, I guess you can put it on top of the matte color if you want to go um, shiny for the day or give it like a satin color instead of a just plain matte, you can. Or if you, if you want to wear it by, by itself, you can do that as well. Our next item up here, I was actually very excited to see that this was part of the box. This is a collection or this is part of the collection that um, Tetris and Ipsy got together for. This is the Block Party eyeshadow palette. So let's see if I can get it out of here. Let's see what it looks like inside. So this is what the outer uh, packaging looks like from the palette. And I think it's actually very cute. Um, let's see the colors. Ooh, those are pretty big pens. Um, these are the colors on in the inside. Skyline, T-Spin, Top Out, High Score, Line Clear, and Back to Back. So those are all terms that are used within the game so i thought i think that's actually pretty pretty cool let's see if i can get some swatches so this first swatch here is skyline they feel really really smooth um not super pigmented but very pretty color that is one there the second swatch is t-spin it is a, a silver metallic. Oh, that's very pretty. That is it there. The third swatch is from Top Out. Ooh, that's very nice. It's a nice um, blue. So let's see this one here. Ooh, that's super pretty. They're all going on really, really nicely, um, especially when you go over them. That's it there. The next one is High Score, which is a nice purple. Ooh, they're all really, really pretty. Um, that is high score there. The next one up is this pink one. This name is Line Clear. That is it there, the very last one. And I'm not going to do a swatch of the last one, the sixth one that we have here. It's back to back. It's a very light pinkish color. Um, that I don't think will show up too much on my skin, especially here on this side. Um, but overall, all the other colors, I think they're they're very, very pretty. I'm just a very horrible uh, swatcher. But I think these are all very, very pretty colors. The last two things in our box, I'm not sure if they're considered one item or two separate ones. But we have, um, I think they go together because here we have... An eyeliner from Suva Beauty, and it is the Hydra Liner, and then it says Cake Liner. Um, and then here as well, we have a brush from Suva Beauty, which is the same company, and it is an eyeliner brush. So this is what the eyeliner pod looks like once you take it out. 
Um, it looks like you have to uh, put water on your brush. And this is our little brush here. It has very, very thin bristles on the top, you know, so your, your line can be perfect. This is super duper thin. Um, I think it gives you the most control when you're trying to uh, do your eyeliner. So I think what happens is you wet your brush and I think you put it in here, if I'm not mistaken, and then you should be able to do your eyeliner. So I think this is awesome. Again, I don't know if it was considered one item or two separate ones, but these are the last items in our box. Really quick, let's go into our pamphlet so we can see the full prices of these. Okay, so I'm just going to go in the order that the pamphlet has the items. I'm going to start with this first one here, 111 Skin, the Vitamin C Brightening Booster. The value for this one is $180. If they are not lying to us, this is a very expensive serum. And $180, that already makes up the whole value of the box. Um, let's see what else we have. The Tristique Matte Color Plus Shiny Balm Lip Crayon, Lip Crayon is $25. Our turmeric mask is $32. Okay, and then these two here, the eyeliner and the brush, they do have them as one as a set here on our pamphlet. And this set, they have it on here for $26. And our very last product, which is our Tetris uh, and Ipsy palette, is $24 so really quick give me one moment let me add all of them up so we can get the value of our box I think this is gonna have a very high value okay so after adding everything up the total value of our box came out to $287 that is a crazy value for a box that I only paid $25 for so far my first box I am very happy with I'm very happy to try out my mask here um, I thought this one, the eyeshadow palette had very cute colors in it. So I'm excited to try this one out. And this uh, serum here, or I mean, I keep calling it serum. I don't know if it's technically a serum, but, but it is a brightening booster. Um, I'm going to try this one out. And the concept here, I think it's very interesting. It's almost like watercolor, but for eyeliner. I'm really excited to try this out. Um, that is all for our box. This is the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus for the month of June. And I am very excited with what we got here. Let me know what you guys think down below. And remember, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like my channel, please go ahead and subscribe. I hope I see you guys next time when I am back with another unboxing. Bye!